Are you mean? <laughs> Are you? Velvet keeps picking on Madam Eleanor. They're total opposites, so I know they're just gonna clash sometimes, but Velvet takes it too far! You really think they're totally opposite? If Madam Eleanor is a white lily, then Velvet is a black rose. If Madam Eleanor is a soaring pegasus, then Velvet is a wolf in the shadows. If Madam Eleanor is a plate of spaghetti carbonara, Velvet is squid ink noodles with seaweed. I don't follow you completely, but I think I get the point. <laughs> I'm sure you understand. The two have nothing at all in common. And since they don't share anything in common, some fighting now and then just can't be helped. Well, they both have beautiful hair. Okay, but we're talking a noble exorcist and an aloof demon. Eleanor sometimes treats you coldly. And Velvet has helped me more times than I can count. Madam Eleanor gives herself fully to the salvation of others. But Velvet is bent solely on revenge. That means they're both motivated by thoughts of others. How is the cheerful and talkative Madam Eleanor at all the same as the brooding, taciturn Velvet? Both of them talk to me when it's just the two of us together. You're just trying to be contrary. I'm only telling you what I've experienced. <laughs> Actually, I feel that Madam Eleanor isn't really reaching out to me. It's all right if Eleanor doesn't want to talk to you. I'm here for you, Bienfu. You aren't alone. That just makes me feel lonelier, <laughs> You two are opposites yourselves. <laughs> <laughs>